Hello guys, uh, this is uh, Coding Magic YouTube channel and today in this video tutorial I'm gonna show you how we can install Gradle uh, to our Windows 10 machine. So basically before we install the Gradle you need to have Java JDK installed in your Windows 10. If you don't have it, Gradle doesn't work. So if you want to install the Java JDK, uh, please first check the Java version. Go to CMD here and in command prompt, uh, let's check the Java status in our Windows 10. So type Java, Java space hyphen version. And as you can see, I have the Java version 15.01 in my Windows 10. If you don't have this one, Gradle doesn't work and you need to install first Java JDK. To install it, check the description part of this video and there is a link. And if you go by this link, there is a video about how to install Java JDK. Watch that video, install the Java JDK, and it can come back to watch this video again. So, uh, and also let me check whether, uh, do I have Gradle or not? So, to check it, we use uh, Gradle, Gradle space hyphen V. It says Gradle is not recognized as an internal or external command. So, basically means we don't have Gradle right now. Or you can check Gradle, Gradle space hyphen hyphen version. As you can see, Gradle is not here. And uh, so what is Gradle actually? Let me give you a brief description about the Gradle. Uh, Gradle is a modern automation tool used in software development for project build automation. Basically, this is a build tool and it's open source and it's based on java so uh, let's install gradle so you need to go to first to google here in the google just type gradle and here you will see gradle.org the first link this is an official link to download gradle uh, build tool so click on the gradle build tool and as you can see here uh, this is an official website for Gradle and it has a lot of information. You can explore and as you can see Gradle is used by LinkedIn, Android, Netflix, Adobe, Elastic and over 10 plus million downloads a month. And this is a top 20 open source project it says. Uh, and then yeah, you will see here this button install gradle in i'm gonna click on install in gradle and also uh, i'm gonna put the link to the description part of this video if you need to go to directly to this uh install a download page of the gradle and here uh if you scroll down you will see prerequisite as i told you need to have java in your windows 10 to be this gradle installed and here you will see the gradle installation uh, command for unix based systems and here you will see the gradle installation command for mac os systems uh, since we are right now downloading it to the uh, windows 10 we need to scroll down and you will see this binary only link and it's the release version 7.1 so uh, we need to download this zip file just click on the binary only link and here you will see the download is started and the size is one of seven megabyte which will take very 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 uh fast since i have the very good internet so uh let me check so in my downloads folder i have this one downloaded zip file and what i'm gonna do i'm gonna unzip this file right click choose any software of your choice to unzip since i have 7zip uh, to uh, to unzip this file i'm gonna use 7zip but you can choose any any uh, software of your choice so i'm gonna extract to gradle server from a bin let me use this one and right now uh, I have extracted file. I'm gonna down, double click, and you see Gradle 7.1. So 
uh, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna copy this file to any location of your choice I'm gonna right click uh, copy I want to see this file in local disk C so here I'm gonna do uh, right click uh, no one second I'm gonna put it here on the program files here and on the program files I'm gonna do right click uh, and past you need provide administrator permission to copy to this folder uh, continue I will say yes Gradle is being copied to the uh, under C as I told you can uh, leave it in downloads also folder or in documents folder it's up to you but I prefer personally to copy this uh, folder under C and under program files uh, yes right now it have copied and next step uh, we need to set the environment variables uh, in your search bar in Windows here type environment environment and it says edit the system environment variables click on this uh, one and here you will see this kind of window and under startup and recovery section you will see environmental variables environmental variables click on the environment variables here basically we need to define two uh, variable first gradle home and path you can add here user variable for your username it will be available to only under on the user or you can define that variables in system variable section which will be valid for all users i'm gonna use system variables one so here uh click new and variable name will be gradle underscore uh, home and then variable value variable value gonna be go to your gradle folder which you have copied to the any location find it gradle 71 and here uh, I'm gonna click this icon and it will automatically select and right click copy I'm gonna go back to my environment section and here I'm gonna do right click past so under program files gradle 7.1 okay next thing we need to add the bin uh, bin location of the gradle to the pass variable so under systems variable you will see the variable called path it can be like this or it can be in the all capital letters doesn't that matter so and here just click edit click on edit and here what we're gonna do is click on new and we're gonna copy the bin folder location so go to your uh, program files open gradle and you have bin folder here double click and copy the uh, path for the bin copy and go back to your environment variables section and here click new you can do ctrl v or right click past and as you can see we have past program files gravel bin folder location okay and here click OK and click OK and let us check here so Gradle space hyphen V it says Gradle is not recognized why because we need to close this pro, uh, command pro because this one is for previous session so I'm gonna close and I'm gonna op reopen CMD it's command prompt press enter and here let's check uh, gradle space hyphen v 
Let's wait. Yeah, it says welcome to Gradle 7.1. Here are the highlights of this release, blah, 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 blah. And it says uh, build time, revision, and Kotlin, Groovy, and JVM operating system. All the information about our system. Uh, thank you, guys. Uh, if you like my video, please don't forget to uh, comment down below if you have any questions. And don't forget to share my video with your friends. Thank you very much.